Good morning and happy Earth Day. Uh, follow me along today to find out how we use technology in the Nest Box program. Let's go. All right, guys, I made it to the beautiful Tanka Verde wash. It's nice and cool this morning, but it's supposed to warm up quite a lot later on. So let's go ahead and walk to our very first Lucy's Warbler Nest Box point. So we're getting close to our first point, but before we get there, I want to go over our materials I'll be using today. I'm going to be using this endoscope, which connects to my smartphone via a Wi-Fi that it emits on its own. This is battery powered, and this will allow me to feed this little camera through and be able to tell what's going on in the nest box. When the nest boxes are very high and out of my reach, I like to use this very handy dandy Swiffer duster handle. Sometimes the solution is very simple. All right, we're almost ready to approach the nest boxes. I get all my equipment ready to limit my time near them to allow for the parents to come back to the nest. And just like that, we were able to tell that there are four eggs inside the nest box. All right, let's go to our next point. As I approach the nest boxes, I can often hear the parents nearby. They're keeping an eye on me. So I make sure that I don't spend too much time there and I walk away from the nest boxes before I even ma start making any notes about what I saw. It's important for us to monitor these boxes weekly because Lucy's warblers nest very quickly compared to, for example, owls that ne take months to raise a brood. So for us to monitor on the regular schedule, we're able to get a, a really good snapshot into their lives and seeing their timing and their behavior and their clutch sizes and their clutch success. So it also means that we're able to tell if, for example, there's a problem. The branch that the nest box was on came loose in the recent storm and we have to move it really quickly. So we're able to do that by monitoring every week. That's why we're so thankful to our volunteers who go out to monitor these boxes because with um, the number of nest boxes that we have around, it will be impossible for us to monitor all of them. Thank you for tuning in today to learn more about how we use technology in the Nest Box program. Um, all of this equipment is made possible by donations just like yours. So thank you and I'll see you next time. Bye.